welcome to South Australia, where there's more flies than humans by about a million to one. It's fantastic. Welcome. Oh, South Australia's put them on for you, have they? This amazing area gets its name, the Breakaways, because of the messes or low-lying hills that sometimes appear broken away from the higher ground of the escarpment. From a distance, the shimmering heat haze, or what is commonly referred to as a mirage, is what causes this effect. This area is so mind-boggling. There are literally millions of holes being dug out of the ground, so you can see millions of rock mounds in every direction. Come down upstairs, and now Diane is checking out this one. With opals. You're going to buy an opal, you buy a solar opal. Solar opal. Otherwise, that's just got other rock underneath it and it's glued. The thin opal is glued on top. Okay. And triplet is a little thinner bit of opal on top. Another rock underneath and then you've got a, like a, a clear... Clear quartz. Wow. Cheapest, mid-price, better, and the ultimate. Come, come, come. It's a black-based solid. Okay. Wow. How do you know all this stuff? I just do. You're an angel. Oh, it's Ben. Ben, no. Oh, that's like he's been here a while. He's petrified. So would you like to stay in a place like this tonight, don't you? Because I wouldn't mind staying somewhere. Billy Bond, you came here today to have a priest. You go to church so that I can confess to her sins. Souvenir. Got writing on. Is that, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, lots of brass. Okay. How are you? Is a busy man. A bit of a woman, Have you been here before? Yeah, I have. Not Party long. Party hard. Party till your brain is scared. Did you know that 80% of Kubipedi residents live underground? The main reason is to escape the heat and the flies on the surface, with its temperature underground being a constant 23 to 25 degrees Celsius. Also, it's easy for miners to build and design their own houses while mining for opals. Alright, Diane. Here we are at Lake Hart. Oh yes, let's go play in the snow. On our way south, we visited Lake Hart which is more often than not a dried up salt lake. This is a massive snow white salt lake that is a stark contrast to the surrounding dusty orange desert. Hi. 